off of that happened in that match? The, the pendulum swung. What, what was it like from your view? Yeah, you're right. Proper football game. So we started really well. We scored a goal. We had the two more. It was controlled. And after we lose two or three duels, and they could run, they could run, they drop us. And after the game was open, they were 50, 20 minutes, they were better. But I had the feeling the first time when we had just a little bit, we could do it. We could do the proper, you know, situation and play and play uh, uh, proper football. And after 3-1, it was difficult, but the team showed who we are. And uh, yeah, a good point for us. Were you surprised that you, you weren't able to control the game as, as you often do? Yes, but uh, we have to be close to Maximin. Maximin is really, really dangerous. Long balls and with uh, strikers, with Wilson, with Jarlington, with Wilco. They win the ball, they play with him. And when they can control the ball, they trap you. The guy will ride left, the ref is so aggressive in a one against one. Even Carlis was amazing the play. The game he played today, you know, we had to defend it in our box. And that's what happened. So it was a little bit transition. We should take more time in the final third. So we want to finish too early the action. They shoot more passes, more passes to avoid this kind of actions. But we were one zero, and and we could contact with Kevin, with Phil, and we can help him make a, you know the movements, the deep runners. They have the, you know the the, the, the tendency, the, the intention to, to finish action. If you finish a score goal, it's brilliant. But if you don't finish, they run, and that's what happened in the first half. What was your view on the on the red card that was overturned? We, we've interviewed Kieran Tripp here. He said he meant to foul him, but he, he felt it wasn't worthy of a red. What, what's your view? I didn't watch. But if the referee saw VAR and saw that it was not red card, what can I say? So, I didn't watch it. Honestly. I saw that in front, and uh, and after that, I didn't watch it. What, what's your view on, on Erling Haaland's part in the team? Because so much has been said on it. And another game now, more time to get used to playing with these teammates. There was one or two passes from Kevin De Bruyne that you could see they're getting on each other's wavelength. Oh uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, so I was more involved the last game. I have a, a goal, a brilliant one. And I had another two or three men to men with the keeper, and the uh, last moment for the control, it would have been good, make a good assist. So, yeah, I was involved, and yeah, a really good game. One goal per game so far. If you can keep that up, you'll be happy. Uh, listen, the statistics is it helps to win, so we will have to have nine points, we have seven, but it's the end of the season. Newcastle away is always difficult for the for many things, and I think the Eddie Howe side, our side, so we make a proper football game. I think all the people enjoying the stadium and TV watching the game and at the end this is where the football is so nice so I think both teams they try to win they give everything and when this happened I never ever can forget absolutely anything